So this is the kind of treatment you can expect to get if you come to the Hall of Fame Festival in Canton, Ohio. Harassment. This is what happens when you don't say you do not consent to any searches or seizures. Don't have the utter focus on this because they don't want to take time and miss it. This is how you get protected and served in Canton, Ohio on Hall of Fame weekend. Got the, uh, now we got the uh, focus on, now you can see the officer. We'll zoom in real nice. Thank God for 1,000 times zoom. I can see into their trunk as well as the officer. The Fourth Amendment in action. This is why when I was in Sandusky, I didn't consent to any searches or seizures. I got a lecture and got sent on my way. I have a feeling this individual is going to get more than a lecture. Who is that? Police. Oh, that's Sam. Inspector. Oh, that's Sam. Who is that? There you go, police harassment at its finest.
notice everyone puts drugs in their engine. Drugs hold up so much better in a hot engine. Are they in the back car? Yep. Yeah, he's in that car there. Then it's like just gonna let him go because it don't look like they found anything. I was in Sandusky and uh, I was pulling out of a gas station and I put my headlights on after I hit the road. And he pulled me over and asked where I was going. I said, you're welcome to my, my license, my insurance, and my proof of registration. He then tells me to get out of the car and ask if he can search it. I said, I do not consent to any searches or seizures. Am I free to go? He goes, oh, one of them. So he sat me in the back of the car and then proceeded to harass my girlfriend. Oh, no. Who said the same things. He put me back in the car and goes, uh, well, you know, if there's anything in that car that we should know about before you drive away, I think you should tell us. I said, you have a good night, officer, and be safe out here. <laughs> yeah, they must have thought they were going to hit the gold mine or something on that. Doesn't look like. I was just talking about this on my show the other day, so it's helpful to post this right afterwards. Yeah. And I. Uh, even with the zoom, I can't make out what they're doing doing in there. If they're just ticketing him or uh, letting him go or what they're doing. The guy's in the car, but... Yeah, I can't. I can zoom into the window, but I can't see through it because of the flashes. Not due to lack of effort, though. I can sure. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Got both license plates. <laughs> His is just a phone number. And my whole house is, uh, I've got the computer streaming video of the house when I'm not home onto a server located uh, wherever. Yeah. That's what I've started doing ever since that stuff becomes so cheap. Oh, yes. Uh, it looks like they are probably going to let him go, so I'm not going to keep filming this. Yes. He's either getting a ticket, we're not going to know about it, because he's probably going to put it in his pocket. But there you go. That's the kind of treatment you get when you come to the Hall of Fame city. I live on Fulton Road, one of the major streets running through the city, and this is how you're treated when you come.